Prime, but for all you knights, you great crusaders, to explore the universe. Well, I commandeered it. It's my personal prison now. Welcome back to the Knights Temenos Prime. You have disgraced it. Join your fellow rebels, fugitive scum. It's for the rarest of specimens, the worst of the worst. It's taken centuries, but I've collected all the knights. But you... Creators want to sweep their chessboard clean. I'm slave to no one. All this species mixing with species. It upsets the cosmic balance. The creators, they don't like it. They built you to do what you were told. I would like to all the queen goddesses, to all the beautiful, lovely star seeds. Tell all my fellow king gods who see the god in me. I see you. I love you, my people. I hope you enjoyed that introduction. The reason why I played that introduction is going to further underline my point in this fucking video. I want to let you know, and I'm not pulling back no punches. XY, black man, including me, we are the fuck in trouble. And when I say in trouble, I mean big time. You know when you sitting in your parents' house or your grandmother's house and you break her favorite vase and she out at church or she out at the market buying something and you like, oh shit, you trying everything in your power to glue and put that shit back together. But you know, because when grandma walked back in that door or grandpa walked back in that door and they see their favorite vase is broke, you know that ass is torn. Let me explain something to you. All this inappropriation, this inner breeding that we're doing, this is the reason why we fail. Each and every time, you do the fucking research, black man. Do the research, my brother. I love you. You know the reason why we fail? Each and every time we procreated with them, we fucking fail. Look at the Asians. That started first. We went in there. We kicked their asses. The black man got spoiled. Stayed in his root chakra. What you don't understand, this entity is playing with science. Playing with science. These people are not light-skinned. When they outside in the sun and the sun is burning their asses, they're not turning dark. Light-skinned people turn dark. They're turning red. They're turning the same color of your root chakra, where your ego is at. We know how all these other races is. We under you, What you don't understand, black man, is that they worshipped you. And you fool falling for this foolishness over and over and over and over. And I'm not exempting myself from you at all because we all connected. My ass is on a line as well. We are all going to be judged. Every last one of us. But I'm giving you the warning right now, black man. The number one thing right now that our star family is looking at is this inner breathing. When we procreated with the Asians, they fucking enslaved us. When we procreated with the Arabs, they enslaved us. Now we procreated with the with the with the Europeans, they enslaved us. And don't give me that bullshit because when Hannibal went over to Rome and he kicked their asses, we could have left. This entity created something red, root chakra, nasty, do anything, as well worship you. You lost your place, black man XY. We lost our we lost our sight. We lost our place. And now let me explain something to you. Everyone is going to know the truth. Everyone's going to know the truth. All this mixing and procreation, all these hybrids out here on the street, those that survived the first wave, go get their asses slaughtered. They're going to get their asses slaughtered. We're going to sit there and we're going to witness that. Every last one of us. Judgment is coming down. I'm not talking to no other races. I'm talking about, I'm talking to you, black man. And this fake negro science oh they they having sex with us and making babies so they can so they can survive so they can listen nothing unnatural is going to survive that's not what they doing they making us look foolish foolish my people ignorant that we are sleeping and procreating with animals we are naturally procre procreating with the nephilim children of the nephilim go back to the original hebrew bible 
and look at the reference again. I was taken by surprise when I learned that the word giant doesn't appear anywhere in the book of Genesis. The word used is Nephilim. According to Jewish and Christian folklore, the Nephilim were supposed to be the giant offspring of fallen angels having sex with human women. But in Hebrew, Nephilim doesn't even mean big, let alone giant. Translated into English, Nephilim actually means the fallen ones. I suddenly realized how it all got mixed up. You see, when the Greeks translated the Bible, they were influenced by their own myths about a giant race of titans. Instead of staying true to the original Nephilim, and by the time the King James Version was written in the 1600s, the word Nephilim had been totally replaced by giants. So, it turns out, I'm not looking for giants at all. I'm looking for the Nephilim. But who were these Nephilim? I think Professor Jerry Schroeder should be able to help me decode this biblical mystery. Genesis is his thing. You know, you read Genesis and there's Nephilim, there's fallen ones. Who are these guys? Well, Nephal, Nephil is a Hebrew word which means fallen or lower down or, or sub, you know, less than perfect. And the Bible says there existed at the time of Adam beings that were completely human in shape and in intelligence. But they weren't humans. They lacked the neshama. The soul. The soul of humanity. Before the neshama, if you didn't look before like... Before the soul. Before the soul of humanity. If you didn't look like me, smell like me, and talk like me, I had you for dinner, literally. It was a doggy, it was a wild world. Kind of humans with souls and humans without. Humans with souls and hominids without. I keep going back there. Human looking beings, but without the neshama, without the soul of human of human life. No fucking such thing as fallen angels. They switched the text from the Hebrew all the way over to English. What's wrong with you? You people have to dig deep. All this information is out there. These are soulless people. People that appear to look human. Appear to have intelligence. To speak with intelligence. But lack the soul. The Neshuma. They say lack the soul. Who else can make purses and pocketbooks out of you? Who else can fucking eat you? Who else can enslave you and make you believe that you evolved from monkeys huh black man and you turn around and you turn your back on your god for money look at y'all with this 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 show power 50 cent you don't understand how all you black men are gonna pay and you all are gonna watch this we all are gonna watch this shit here how you 50 cent got the movie power you how you know how that displays us you know how that displays us we, we got a, a cold, dysfunctional fucking family that's used to going in and out of the system and killing people. Are you serious, my people? And we watching that, rushing home to watch that instead of rushing her home to research UVA, UV, UVB, and UVC. Not understanding that the ozone layer is fucking being removed and these people can't even walk out the door. But black man, you rather, I see you in the gyms and fucking flirting with these beasts. You rather lay down and procreate with this beast instead of turn back to your God. And don't worry, she's next too. Because she's going to witness. Everyone is going to know the truth. Everyone is going to know the truth. But I'm going to tell you, black man, we are the reason why this shit started in the beginning. Our fucking egos. The moment that a pharaoh was introduced to us, this is when we started to fucking fall. There is no one individual mind. This like is no one part of the universe. We got cocky. We got deep into our ego. We lost sight of the light. And guess what? We gonna get our asses handed to us. So black man, be prepared. Talk that bullshit quick. You you really you 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 ready to shoot your brother out in the street. You ready to beat your brother up in the street. But as soon as these cops run up and run in one of the houses and rough up one of these queens, you pull out your cell phones and start recording. And then you march down in the neighborhoods with the same genetic motherfuckers that's fucking killing you. And you're and you're breeding with the same people that fucking like their meat medium rare. Blood that made purses and pockets of books out of you and sold you on a stock market and dumbed you down. Made you believe that you are fucking nothing. And now you're procreating with these fucking people. You think it's you think it's about you think it's about money? You turned to money and turned away from your fucking God. And now your ass is gonna pay. Laying down with the Nephilim children. Laying down with these beasts. 
You don't understand the trickery that has been played on us and you play right into it, black man. You don't understand right above your head daily. Our star family is watching you, are looking at you, looking at your displayment out here. You you turn to this beast with love. Turn to and XY, you XX, you're gonna pay too. I'm not gonna leave you out, but you're gonna witness this shit first. You're gonna witness. It's a reason why it's only gonna take a small percentage of us to repopulate this fucking planet. This planet is being wiped out. Two homes are being set up, and two and it's gonna be two separations. You can mark my fucking word on that X Y. You are going to pay. They put all this shit in the movies. He said, "What? What did he say to? What? Optimus Prime fell in love with the human race. He got in his ego. He ain't had nobody over top of him to oversee him. He fell in love with the fucking human race, just like we did when we went over in Rome and, and Asia and in Europe, just like we went over there, huh? We fell in love with them. They was worshiping us, and then all of all that they we playing right into this entity hand, procreating with them. And each time we went the fuck into slavery. And black man, you still can't see this. Talk about some man God still freezing my black woman's mind, still trapping her, still trapping her. But I'm telling you, we are going to pay big time, and I'm not leaving myself out of here, out of this at all. Because guess what? I know that we are all connected as one. So we are all going to be judged, but we also going to be judged individually as fucking well. We're also going to be all you NBA players, all you fucking entertainers. Like I said, that movie Power 50 Cent, you got a white boy sleeping with black women all through the fuck passing off Himalayas disease. Come on, man. This is this is sickening to me, my people. And you got a white boy running through the black community, just killing people and, and running shit. An animal, cuz. And look how you got the look how you got the black family. You got him walking around with a shirt and tie, but still killing, selling drugs. It's totally dysfunctional and you don't even see the message that was sent to ghosts in the, in the movie sometimes the message don't always come directly to the motherfucker that's doing all the work you got your daughter your daughter life was taken and you still involved in it your, your whole family is dysfunctional look at the every so many women i look at you sisters out here how much how many of y'all love that ghost wife how you love her her whole family is dysfunctional she is the god of her family and her whole fucking family is dysfunctional. she more concerned about the dollar which she's more concerned about the dollar and her business and wearing materialistic shit than, 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 than freeing her children and keeping them away from this satanic demonic world. Looking beautiful on the outside, but devilish on the inside. Can't even see it. Dysfunctional. All of you are going to pay for this shit. The XY, you have no idea what's heading your fucking way. No, I fucking did. And let me explain something to you. Everyone that survived the first wave, all you fucking mulattoes going into bondage, or you gonna be, or you gonna get fucking slaughtered. And all you black men out here that continue to procreate and continue to turn your back on your planet, turn your back on nature, continue to turn your back on your brother and sister, continue to turn your back on your on your god of humanity, you are going to pay fucking big time, big time. No questions added about it now you can you can say whatever you want to me you can call me racist or not even fucking racist you can say i'm out of my mind but i'll tell you what look at my previous videos look at them this is a vision that i'm telling you your ass is going to be handed to you and let me explain something to you these entities on this planet would rather wish the planet just destroy itself rather than the truth for the truth to come out because guess what the truth is so fucking harsh the truth is more disturbing than the fucking lie that was told to you. All this species mixing with species. It upsets the cosmic balance. The creators, they don't like it. They built you to do what you were.